Welcome back to the channel. I'm Dylan from the In My Twenties podcast. And today I'm going to be showing you how you can set up GarageBand to record your podcast and how to record two microphones at once in GarageBand. Firstly, go and open GarageBand right here, as you can see. So once you've opened GarageBand, it should come up saying choose an empty project. We want to select choose an empty project and then it will bring up this menu on screen right now. And you can see that there's plenty of different options here. And assuming you've got both of your microphones connected to your computer, which you should do by now, you then want to hit command and spacebar on a Mac and search MIDI. Now this will bring up the audio MIDI setup and you want to double click on the audio MIDI, set MIDI setup and then it will bring up this menu right here. Now there's lots of gobbledygook on my menu, but in yours it will probably be a lot clearer. But essentially what you want to do and what I will do is scroll down, press plus, create aggregate device. This will bring up a new one here. Let's call it, uh, I'll call it YouTube or two mics. Enter. And we want to tick our two microphones that are currently plugged in to our computer on this menu right here. So both of my microphones are Rode NT USB and you can see that, and you can see that the only Rode NT USB microphones with an input, which is IN, are this one right here and this one right here. So once I've selected these two, I'm done with this menu. I'm now going to leave it. And essentially what will happen is on GarageBand, it will pop up saying, do you want to use the audio device, um, YouTube two mics? And you want to say use, and you want to say use again, and it will initial and it what it will do it it will initialize the core audio down here. My instrument is connected with to YouTube two mics, and if it doesn't do this automatically, basically just change the input device manually like so, and your menu will pop up here. And then once again, you want to make sure this is selected on input one and two, not just one or not just two. And then we want to go ahead and create record a microphone or input, and press create. Now, once this menu comes up, we want to make sure we create another audio channel because each audio channel is represented by um, a different mic. And you can see for one, we have um, the top one, let's say, we'll select uh, YouTube two mics one to two. And for the second one, we'll select YouTube two mics three to four. And now we're basically there. Both mics are set up, but however, they're not recording at the same time. So what you need to do is um, basically the very top, I know you can't see this on my screen, but there's a GarageBand menu. You want to press um, track and then show track composition or configure track header right here. So track, configure track header. And then we want to select recording enabled and that'll pop up on the screen. And then we now want to press the shift key, which is the output arrow, click on the first record, click on the second record. And now both channels are going to be recording if and when you hit the record button and then you can slap record. Both channels are recording. We have one mic here, one mic here. You can see that they're both different levels, so, you know. And you can see that both of them are recording, both of them are recording at different levels and boom, you're ready to start recording your podcast. Once it's done, you simply hit pause, share, export and the podcast is done. So also, I should just add, I recently created a free Skillshare where you can go and learn all about how to start a podcast from nothing to pro and that'll be linked in the description down below for any budding podcast hosters or people wanting to learn and create a podcast it covers marketing to how to record to how to grow it so that'll be linked below thank you for watching this please feel free to check out my podcast i'm dylan subscribe like yes